When people find out we've been touring Europe for several years, one of the most common questions is, where's the best place you've ridden? And man, that's tough to answer. Do I pick the place with the best scenery? Or the best roads for bikes? Or the best weather? Or a place which is just so freaking cool I had to pinch myself as we were riding there? In just over three years, we visited 16 countries across Europe. We haven't ridden every road, and there are some famous ones which are still on our list. But of all the places we have been, here are five of our favourites. Let's start with one of the most incredible roads we've ever had the pleasure of riding on. This jaw-dropping road is Strada della Fora, and it's literally built into the cliffs on the west side of Lake Garda in northern Italy. This road is famous for several reasons, including being used as a setting of a James Bond car chase, but yet it's still not crazy busy. You can't drive it in anything bigger than a 4x4, the tunnels are too low, but on a motorcycle it's perfect. The road has a traffic light system through the steepest and narrowest section, so you don't need to worry about oncoming traffic whilst looking at the views. And if you're on a bike, there's a small lay-by where you can stop and enjoy taking some of the best photos of your motorcycle you'll ever get. Now, this is footage which my daughter took, bless her, and she angled the camera the wrong way. But don't let that detract you from the epicness of this road. It's incredible to ride. Next up is the breathtaking Trollstigen, which literally means Troll's Ladder in Norwegian. Situated in the northern part of southern Norway, this incredible road is another one that's built right up a cliff. However, unlike Strada della Fora, this one is two-way, and as well as cars and bikes, you'll also get buses, trucks and coaches whizzing up and down, barely able to fit on a road with a very, very steep cliff over the side. For this one, we decided to ride two up so that I could hold the GoPro. We don't do this very often, but on roads like this, I think it was well worth it because I'm not sure you'd have been able to appreciate the views if it had just been fixed to the bike. Another place we loved is the Furka and Grimsel passes in the Swiss Alps. Now we sadly rode these before we thought about GoPros or YouTube or anything like that, but that doesn't take away how amazing these roads are. Seriously, if you like twisty roads, hairpins and fantastic views, add these to your bucket list right now. Whilst you're on the roads, be sure to stop at the Gelmerbahn Funicular which is one of the oldest and steepest mountain railways in existence. It goes up a gradient of 106%. Oh, Smile. Ready? <laughs> 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 That's cool. And right at the bottom of that funicular is an amazing rope bridge right across the canyon, which is probably not a place for you if you don't like heights, but it's got incredible views as well. We're in the Black Forest. Hang on, I'm doing a 360. Look, oh, it was 
JD. There she is. Hi, JD. Ta da! We are somewhere in the Black Forest. Look how beautiful it is. Isn't it gorgeous? And we have pulled up right by this amazing 180 bend. It's got, just biker it's heaven gorgeous, here. Yeah. It's gorgeous. Bike trick squad. How are we enjoying the Black Forest so far? It's amazing. It is actually amazing, isn't yeah. it? But some part of me is hoping for tonight. You ready? Go! No! No! no. The final spot was really tough to fill because there were so many places which could have made it. But in the end, it went to this one because it was just so cool to be able to ride there on a bike. We didn't have our GoPros, but yes, we had our dog. So we're coming back from Menton and we're on our bikes. We're having a grand old time and then we saw a sign. And this happened. We're in Monaco. Like a 360. It's cool, it's gorgeous, and it's warm. There's so much money here, it's ridiculous. So, um, yeah, no, we're gonna go and buy a tourist thing. Max enjoying himself. Hello, say hi. Hi. Hello. Um, yeah, we're gonna go explore Monaco. We're walking across the Monaco race circuit. Boom! One of the coolest things about touring is there are always more places to explore. If you'd like to know more about motorcycle travel or how we got started, you might find these videos helpful. Thanks for watching.